Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to export vector files to Blender. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back. And for example, I will use this sample logo and this is only with shape layers. And let's go to file and save as and file name. Let's write logo and save as type. We can choose here SVG file, click save. And we can keep default settings, SVG options, and click OK. Next step, let's open Blender. Go to File, Import. And as you can see here, SVG file here. Let's click, choose Logo SVG file. Click Import. Our logo is here. And first of all, we can choose here vector files like this. And also and we can go to edit mode let's see and we can select all of them points and let's back to object mode and select these curves go to object and join or control g let's click for join and right now again we can choose here edit mode so in this time select this curve and press s change scale Let's change scale more. Okay, and select this curve and right mouse. Go to set origin and geometry to origin. And let's add extraction. Select this curve and go to click this icon and close shape and open geometry. And change extrude like this. Okay, very nice. And let's back to materials. Let's click X for delete and create new material. Choose here base color yellow. And click here for C material. Okay, let's choose like this. So, in this time we have problem, let's fix it. We can see problem is here with black lines. And for fix this problem, select this curve. And go to data open shape and we can fix this problem with resolution preview let's change this 100 okay here we go it works and for render also we can write here 100 nice and select this curve let's select rotation tool and chain rotation like this and moved up okay here we go and right now let's go to render icon go to here and change render engine cycles and device here and the noise also go to world and color let's click here and environment texture and click open and go to program files blender foundation blender 4 and 4 again and data files studio lights and word folder and we can use these environment images for example let's use city and click open image okay very nice and back to render and go to down let's open film and for transparent background click this checkbox nice very good and back to materials can change roughness like this for reflection so guys thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel like video leave comments and have a good day good luck